Second period comes to an end. And Sidney Crosby is doubled over, heading to the bench in some pain, clearly. Here's Crosby. And he just... Oh, oh yeah. Hammer. Steckel got him. Wow. So uh, I remember when Crosby got hit, it got a lot of people's attention. It was like the first time a star player got a concussion and a serious head injury. Now uh, in minor hockey, um, so really since the, the Crosby hit, uh, there's a lot more emphasis now on the referees calling uh, a new penalty, what they call uh, the headshot penalty. And uh, even be incidental, where, um, you know, like a high sticking penalty where it could be accidental and um, the uh, player will uh, be assessed a two minute minor penalty and if it's intentional then um, the referee has a lot of discretion to uh, penalize the player at least four minutes and uh, perhaps even eject the player from the, from the game. It's really dangerous for kids out there and it, it just has to promote player safety and kids tend to go for headshots and not really go for the body because of their anger and they tend to lose their temper and forget about the game entirely. And the additional headshot penalty helps prevent that from happening. One incident that I remember, and it was a little bit different for me because I was a goalie so I wasn't involved in um, the body contact that some of the players were, although it did get a rough around the net sometimes. but. Um, yeah, in one particular case, uh, I had one of those um, masks that was uh, made uh, for my face, the old uh, Tony Esposito type of mask. And um, one time uh, I was in a tournament and a uh, uh, opposing player came in uh, and took a really hard slap shot from the face-off circles and I didn't have a chance to move. It hit me right in the forehead and, uh, and I went down and um, Play stopped immediately, and uh, I had to be taken off the ice, and um, uh, couldn't continue playing. Um, it was a pretty major tournament, so they had a doctor uh, in the arena, uh, which they normally uh, wouldn't have otherwise. And um, the doctor uh, asked me a few questions, and uh, um, you know, I said uh, I felt fine, and. Uh, pretty much went on my own, went back, uh, joined the team, and that night, um, you know, I had all the symptoms of a concussion, uh, sick to my stomach, um, headaches, and, um, you know, was uh, pretty much left uh, on my own to, um, uh, to decide how I should um, proceed. After I got my concussion, there was, it was just, it happened so fast and I didn't even know what happened and then the trainer came out and all the next thing I knew, he was asking me a bunch of questions and by the time he was done asking his questions, I realized that I was off the ice and then I heard that the next time I could play, I had to get a doctor's note to come back and I had to get do a bunch of these tests and go through physiotherapy and everything. And, it was just a horrible time because I just wanted to be out there so bad playing the game I love.